All right, Notion hasn't done it. <clears throat> All right, Notion hasn't done it, so I'm gonna show you three different ways that you can sync Google Calendar and Notion because good Lord, it, I'm, I'm just sick of it not being a native thing. So first and foremost, we have notionautomations.com. I've done a full-fledged review of this and tutorial, but long story short, what you get with Notion Automations is the ability to sync your Notion and Google Calendar very very easily. When you go into my account, what you'll see is something that's disabled, but long story short, what it allows you to do is actually pick which different calendars you have within here, and then connect it to a specific database that I had, like my task and event database syncing to it. And it's a very simple and easy to use product that's actually only $4 a month. And they actually, and they have a very nice public feature requests and a roadmap that's on the board. They're looking into all these different things and they showcase to you whether it's planned in consideration as they are actually adding things like a Todoist integration pretty soon. I've chatted with the owner of the software before and great guy, very simple and easy to use application. The affiliate link will be down below as well as reference to the first video I made on it. Definitely a great option for you. Secondly, you can use make.com. So. Zapier is not really an option due to the limitations that the API has in my opinion. However, with make.com, I have implemented an entire four step automation. So this Notion Google Calendar one, these are the four ones that I have on and essentially it syncs whether you make a new calendar event in Google Calendar, it'll make something in Notion. If it's a recurring one, it'll keep searching for those different ones so that instead of you having to create one every week when a recurring task pops up, that doesn't have the exact same name as the one that's already made, it will sync in again. And anytime you make an update to the time within Google Calendar or within Notion, they'll also sync to each other. So just to showcase how that's working for me currently, I'll go to my meetings and notes and you'll see right here that tomorrow I have a sync with my editor. And one thing to mention is the fact that make.com is on mountain time. So when looking at it through this lens, it does kind of throw it off for a second, but clicking in here, you'll see that it's at 715 to 745. But say I looked at it from here and I wanted to add a meeting right before that. Let's do a new meeting example, then go to meetings, then put a little silhouette there just for funsies and added myself as an attendee and added a virtual room for a Google Meet press send. What you'll see here is that this guy is set to run every three hours. So when that's made, bada bing, bada boom, we'll see that within Notion, this new media example pops up at 6.45 to 7.15. But if I wanted to set this to 6.15 instead, and I go back in here, I have one that searches events and updates within Notion. So if I press this, watch database items, it looked like I just updated something. So let's go here. Let's update this event, so 6.15 to 6.45. That would mean that since I moved it there, it would update the event to right here. Now this is something that we all want and need with a Notion, but if you're not willing to do the work or even like take the templates that I have using the Notion app system and then this on top of it, you can always go with Bardeen. So Bardeen is a great AI software. The owner is a really cool guy and what he's been able to do is make exceptional integration. So if we go to Notion, we'll see that there are some capabilities to sync with not only Google Calendar, but things like Google Sheets and other applications as well. Bardeen even has a article on this, which is pretty funny. And shout out to the owner for this logo, hilarious. It's got a browser extension built in and is a very functional application with a lot of cool things within it. If you're interested in learning how to implement any of these yourself or want a full stack option for your Notion workspace, make sure to reach out to me. Otherwise, definitely check out the Notion app system as it is very simple to get a Google Calendar sync set up with make.com using our template. And it's also easier to improve your productivity if you check out this video right here.